Oh, how I've longed to see you, Viajito. Grandpa, instead of spines, you have trichomes, hairs, to protect you from uh, those dry temperatures in the sun. We're at 6,200 feet elevation, looking at Cephalosirius cenalis, a really unique cactus. The genus Cephalosirius is endemic to Mexico. God damn, look at that. Look at all that air. See, spines are not always, spines on cacti are not always protective, at least not from herbivores. Sometimes they're protective from drying out and from the sun. And that's what's happened here. These spines have been morphed into trichomes, into hairs. I've actually got a seedling of this that I grow, and it does well in South Texas because that all those trichomes protect it from both the sun uh, as well as the occasional frost we get now when we get a polar vortex because the jet stream is all fucked up and you get bursts of cold air blowing down from up north. Wild. Growing with Pinus pinciana. The weeping pine. Where cephalosirius and pines grow together. Fucking wild flora here. And the Hualia hypoluca asteraceae. It's a tree composite. Some species of uh, Agratina in the Stevia tribe. Dodonea viscosa right there. Maple family Sapindaceae. Wonderful array of uh, columnar jointing. Another uh, weeping pine. Whole host of cool species. You got a kind of agave striata down there. Uh, there was Dermatophyllum down there as well. Oh yeah, right there. Mountain laurel, as they call it in Texas. No relation to laurels. But this guy, I've been wanting to see you for a while, buddy. You know, oh, and you got little clumps of Tillandsia on you. That's nice. Look at that. That's it's adorable. How fucking old. You got a couple centuries. wonder what the average annual rainfall is. Probably 20 to 25 inches. You get some decent rain down here. But again, uh, then you've got a long dry season. Now, there's a weird one, too. Macharonia coulteri from uh, Rubiaceae, the coffee family. You don't often see members of the coffee family, at least not shrubby ones, in dry areas, in arid areas, even though this is seasonally arid. Well, wealth of floristic diversity, but you're, you're really what I'm excited about. You got a beautiful minty green color. Most of the hairs, the cephalium, from the name Cephalosirius, most of the hairs are at the top protecting that apical meristem as well as where it flowers. They flower at the top. The hairs help protect the flowers. That's all I got. Have a great rest of your day. Go fuck yourself. Bye.